Let's talk about the quandary. Lance. So this is this is the picture. We've got some unknown force, right? We've already figured out that the acceleration is negative 5.714. Why is it um, why is it negative? It's slowing down. It's moving to the right. It's moving to the right, yes, but it's slowing down. Okay. We also don't even need to think too hard, right? Because we're using v final as v i plus a t, right? And so the final is zero. The initial. Can we stop, please? Please stop talking. I promise you, you'll be able to talk. I promise that you will be able to talk later, but not right now. Okay. So it's it's uh, v is is this plus a t, right? And t is um, 2.1 seconds. Okay. And so when you solve this, when the 12 goes over here, it becomes negative 12, and then you divide by 2.1, that's why it's negative, right? Or you, it's just negative because it's slowing down, right? Um, and then the friction, you go 0.48 times this times this, you get 103 point, it's like 488 or something, isn't it? Yeah, is that what it is? Okay, and then you set up your equation, right? And the equation is unknown force minus the friction force. Why is the friction force negative? Sliding to the right, so the friction force is to the left, and everything to the left is negative, yes? Right, so, so you know, all these things we gotta think of, right? So some uh, no unknown force minus the friction force, right, is equal to, what is it, 22 times negative 5.714, yeah? And then we can solve that for F, which isn't too hard, I don't think. So 22 times negative 5.714 plus 103.5, 22.208 negative. Now, probably looking at this problem, unless you're like Rain Man, you know, and you can just look at that and go, oh, I, I see instantly, right? You probably didn't know whether this unknown force was to the right or the left, did you? Maybe not. Okay. Some people do. They know, but I, I don't know. Right. So, the way you solve these things is you just have to be really careful about these forces. Right. Is it positive? Is it negative? Is the acceleration positive? Is it negative? Did anybody try doing it with a positive acceleration? Did you get the right answer? Yeah. You don't get the right answer. It doesn't work. Right. So you've got to you've got to be really careful with your minus signs in these friction problems as you're solving them. If the thing's slowing down, it's probably a negative acceleration. Right, speeding up, it's a positive. You got to put that in there. Draw a picture of it. That always helps. Okay. Um, yes.